The fact is, uh, founders get undue credit for what they do. Though it's an Entrepreneur of the Year award, it's actually a recognition of every team member who has played a role in the last uh, 10 years. As we all know, the past year was a real test of our uh, collective human spirit. With pandemic closing massive disruption in ec across all sectors, it was an unexpected challenge for businesses to navigate a crisis of this magnitude. However, I believe every challenge is an opportunity to better ourselves and to create a positive impact. For us, this meant adapting to school closures to make sure that uh, learning didn't stop. During the peak of the lockdown, we made all our content free. We saw 40 million students joining our free platform in the last 10 months. And we are fortunate to be in a segment which is of positive relevance during a crisis like this. Moments like this make you happy because uh, it, it's a validation that you are on the right path. But there is no scope for complacency as there is a long way to go before we will call it a success. But I hope awards like this inspire many more people to actually follow their dreams. So the jury was looking for an individual who had dramatically transformed uh, uh, area where the, the, the entrepreneur was uh, was operating in and uh, built a certain scale which had a big big impact uh, not only in that particular area but also at a national level. So I would uh, like to congratulate uh, Baiju Ravindran because he has dramatically transformed India's learning landscape and I strongly believe that innovation in the area of education, agriculture and healthcare is going to be the way forward for India to uh, make uh, uh, to make a, a quantum jump in terms of whatever we are doing. And I think Baiju has shown this uh, uh, in a fantastic way. Uh, uh, the company is also uh, very well respected. It's also reflected in its valuation and the overall interest uh, uh, amongst the investors as well as all the stakeholders. Forbes India Leadership Awards 2020-21